Hello everybody, um, <clears throat> welcome back to another Minecraft tutorial. So, on this video, we're going to be showcasing our automatic potion maker. Um, so basically what you can see here is, um, my, my water bottles, my blaze powder for the alchemy <coughs> table, um, and then the nether wards for the brewing stand, and the lamps show that there's enough to make whatever we're trying to make. So, right here you can see, this is the blaze powder for strength potion, swiftness, uh, regeneration, uh, no, insta-heal, regeneration, fire resistance, uh, resistance, and water breathing. Over here we have glowstone and versus redstone so if you flip it to redstone that will make the potion last longer and if you flip it to glowstone that makes it uh, a stronger effect and this is whether or not you want it to be a splash potion with the, with the gunpowder turned off makes it not a splash potion so I like to have I would like to have a splash um, insta heal potion uh, with extra effect so let's go ahead and push this button um, and that will push some glis glistering melons into the alchemy table so that way we can get a potion so you press that button you see that the, the potions are loaded up into the station and you can check here it starts off with nether wart first and then you got the water bottles right then next it's gonna be <clears throat> glistering melon And then you got glowstone dust for the next one to give it extra effect. So that's instant health number two. And now we're going to be turning it into splash potions. and then they automatically deposit into this chest below like and favorite if uh, you enjoyed the video thank you